She's a great big fan of you. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 awkward celebrity fan interactions. I'm not gonna punch someone in the face, okay? For this list, we'll be looking at meetings that reportedly occurred between famous stars and their fans that didn't exactly go as planned, with thanks to BuzzFeed for some of these stories. Have you ever had an awkward run-in with a celebrity? Let us know in the comments. Number 10. Coolio Is there anything more embarrassing than spilling your drink on someone you don't know? What if the person you spilled that drink on was Coolio? This messy mishap was the reality for one fan who tried to take a selfie with the Gangsta's Paradise rapper and ended up covering him in beer. What's worse, the resulting photo was reposted to Reddit where it briefly went viral in 2015. In a now-deleted tweet, the fan, going by the name Keela Kardashian, warned others, quote, not to read the comments if they ever went viral on the website. Good advice then and now. Number 9. Dave Matthews Dave Matthews is a well-known singer, songwriter, and occasional actor who owns his own record label and has been performing with the Dave Matthews Band since 1991. Unfortunately, none of Dave Matthews' acclaim in the music industry or elsewhere were enough for the boss of one Starbucks employee to recognize him, as he didn't allow the musician to use the coffee shop's employees-only bathroom despite a staff member asking on Dave's behalf. Unable to fulfill Matthews' request, another nervous employee allegedly offered the Crash Into Me singer an empty cup to take with him. According to the community member who recounted the encounter to BuzzFeed, Dave then looked, quote, at them like they were all completely insane. Number 8. Sophie Turner It happens to everyone. You get caught in a situation where you need to write something down, but your only pen is out of ink. We can only imagine that this aggravating common occurrence is even more infuriating when you need the pen to get an autograph from your favorite celebrity. This was the case for one fan of Game of Thrones star Sophie Turner, who wrote on Twitter about the time her pen stopped working when the actress went to sign her poster. In a moment of desperation, the fan attempted to make the pen work, only to rip the poster she'd brought to sign. Thankfully, the story had a happy ending in spite of the awkward circumstances, as she was eventually able to borrow a pen and get Sophie's signature. Number 7. Emma Watson Many dream of having chance encounters with their favorite celebrities, but few are actually prepared for the situation when it happens. One man allegedly found this out the hard way when he found himself face to face with Harry Potter star Emma Watson with nothing for her to sign. Desperate for a memento, he ripped out a page of the magazine he was reading and ended up handing the actress a page about toilet habits. We're sure that Emma Watson has had a lot of strange fan moments over the years after starring in such a popular franchise, but that didn't stop her from giving this guy a funny look for his choice in articles. What a load of rubbish. Where did you come from? <laughs> Me? Been here all this time. Number 6. Dolly Parton Get away to Dollywood. It's homespun. Typically, when you hear stories about people throwing up at a theme park, it's because of a winding roller coaster or a ride with a sudden drop. It can be a totally natural reaction to an unnatural sensation. Oh. I'm not so sure about this. Even theme park owner Dolly Parton has said that she refuses to ride theme park rides herself as she has, quote, a tendency to get motion sickness. The fact that I don't ride the rides makes the kids want to ride them even more. They think this must be really scary if I won't even ride them. As told to BuzzFeed, it wasn't a ride that caused one fan to lose their lunch at Dolly's Park Dollywood, though. Instead, the fan threw up out of apparent excitement when she saw Dolly Parton herself riding around in a carriage at the park. Talk about an embarrassing first impression. Number 5. Aubrey Plaza while many people would happily settle for a selfie or autograph from their favorite celebrity, one fan wanted a little more out of Aubrey Plaza. How dare you! The Parks and Rec star was at a bar when a man came up to her and asked her to punch his friend in the face. He even offered her $20 to do it. Unfortunately, Aubrey Plaza wasn't as into the idea as he was and declined the offer. She described the incident in an interview promoting her 2020 film Black Bear, and added that she frequently meets fans who want her to be mean to them, likely due to the number of ill-tempered characters she played early in her career. I'm not gonna punch someone in the face, okay? Unless they really deserve it. So maybe I would just 
instead of money, I would go, well, why don't you tell him to do something to me, you know, say something to me that would make me want to punch him in the face. I need to be motivated. I'm an actor. Number four, Justin Bieber. Everyone has told a bad joke at some point in their lives. You set it up, deliver the punchline, and are met with deafening silence. People are hating on him because Chump is always firing people, but it's kind of okay because he completely let himself go anyway. It's often embarrassing, but few can say that their bad jokes actually got them escorted out of a building. Get off me, man! Get off me! This BuzzFeed community fan member can, though. When pop star Justin Bieber was just 17, a fan that was a few years older decided that it would be funny to ask him if he farted and to follow that question up with the line, quote, because you just blew me away. The baby singer was reportedly creeped out by the line instead of charmed, since said fan was promptly kicked out by security. Number three, David Tennant. I'm the doctor. I'm a time lord. I'm from the planet Gallifrey in the constellation of Casterberus. I'm 903 years old, and I'm the man who's going to save your lives and all six billion people on the planet below. For a lot of people, running into your favorite celebrity in public could be a once-in-a-lifetime occurrence. I mean, it's not weird. It's just kind of... Well, I never thought I'd meet you. I mean, I never even imagined it, but here you are. Whether you happen to see them at a film festival or in a grocery store, it can be hard not to run up to them and let them know that you're a fan. But what if the place you saw your favorite celebrity was in the gym showers? To his chagrin, this awkward meeting spot didn't stop one fan from approaching Doctor Who alum David Tennant and asking for an autograph. Fortunately, the encounter didn't sour the star to all sci-fi fans, who he's said, quote, get a bad rap for their impassioned love for the genre. You know, people asking for an autograph in the shower at the gym, that's quite... No. That's in quite my weird. defense, I didn't know you were <laughs> Number two, Brad Pitt. A lot of people have a fear of birds. It makes sense, especially when they're flying around your head, seemingly threatening to clip you with their beak or leave poop in your hair. Hey, no touching allowed. One girl recounts feeling this fear of birds in full force when a pigeon dive bombed by her teenage head. It was only after the fact that she realized Brad Pitt was standing near her, helplessly watching her scream in terror. She told BuzzFeed that it was, quote, the most devastating thing that could happen to a 14-year-old girl. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Charlie XCX Singer-songwriter Charlie XCX rose to prominence when she collaborated with Icona Pop on their hit song I Love It, and two years later, released Boom Clap as a single on the Fault in Our Stars soundtrack. She became an international sensation, with a fan following she lovingly referred to as her angels. Unfortunately, some of those angels would begin to test her limits in 2019 when one fan asked her to sign their douche and another asked her to pose with their mother's ashes. Shortly after a few of these fan interactions made their rounds on Twitter, Charlie tweeted out a vague message, simply saying, quote, "...have some respect, that's all." Though she later clarified the tweet wasn't about the objects in question, it's still a sentiment we should all keep in mind when meeting our favorite stars. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.